Hi, this is Juan from the KSAMS and welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be showing you how to play Minecraft Classic on a touchpad without using the buttons. This is a video in response to this comment in my most popular video, Building a House in Minecraft Classic. So, why am I not going to use the buttons? Well, it's because there's actually a type of touchpad that doesn't have the buttons. I'm not talking about the buttonless touchpad on MacBooks. They actually still have the buttons, but it is in touch form. I'm talking about the haptic touchpad, which has no buttons whatsoever. So how do you play Minecraft Classic on this type of touchpad? Well, go get yourself a mouse. Wow, that was a quick tutorial. Just kidding. I'm actually going to show you how to do it. The first thing I tried is seeing if I could change the keybinds for the left and right mouse buttons in Minecraft Classic. But there doesn't seem to be that option. Now, at the top left of the screen, you can see my hand on the touchpad and what gestures I can make with it. I don't actually own a haptic touchpad, but I read that the left and right mouse buttons are the same as the other types of touchpads. Now let's go through some of the gestures. You can move the camera by moving a finger over the touchpad, but most people know that already. To left click, you tap the touchpad with one finger. This will break the blocks since it's in break mode. To right click, you tap the touchpad with two fingers. This will switch between the two modes. On some touchpads, you can do a middle click by tapping the touchpad with three fingers. That's not the case with my touchpad. It just brings up the search box. Four fingers doesn't work either. It will bring up the notifications tab. Last of all, to scroll through the heads up display to select a block, you run two fingers from the top of the touchpad to the bottom like this. That's it for this video. If you've enjoyed, be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching. See ya.